I'm going to teach you how to do a multi-size perm rod set. We'll need leave-in conditioner, shea butter, coconut oil, and you will also notice that I have three different size perm rods, a large, medium, and a small size. I begin on freshly conditioned hair, and I'm just going to separate it into two sections. Here you'll notice that I'm applying this Shea Moisture, the leave-in conditioner, and the coconut oil so I can have moisture in my hair. I start off finger parting my hair. You can choose any size perm rod you want, but I like to start off with the smaller sizes in the front of my head. So it's pretty simple. You just start off with the ends of your hair and you roll the perm rod to the top, making sure that you clamp it so it stays tight. You will notice that I use different size perm rods but the process is still the same. You start at the ends, you roll to the top, and you clamp it tight. These are the finished results of one side of my head. Now just continue that same process that you did on one side of your head and do the same thing on the opposite side. It helps if you maybe put the same rollers in the same spot just so it balances out. Now you can see both sides completed with the perm rod set in. I decided to sit under the dryer, but you can also air dry. Once your hair is completely dry, you're just going to unravel the perm rods. You're going to go in the same direction as the curls so you don't mess anything up or cause any frizz. Here I'm showing you what one side will look like once you remove the perm rods. This is the look once you remove all of the perm rods. You can keep this polished look, but I prefer my hair to be a little bigger and the curls separated. I just take a little bit of coconut oil and put it in my hands to separate the curls without getting any frizz. Here's the finished look after I separated and fluffed the curls. If you have any questions or any advice, just leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching!